A recent high school graduate in the Poconos was accepted into more than 50 colleges and universities, receiving about $2 million in scholarships. Newswatch 16's Amanda Eustis spoke with the teen who's getting ready to start her college experience earlier than most. Dillard, University of Charlotte, Harris-Stowe State University, Hampton University. Sydney Smith from East Stroudsburg High School South always knew she wanted to go to college. She just didn't know which one. There was no school that I was dead set on. I just like to like have options and see them. When it was time to apply, she didn't waste any time. Her first acceptance letter came in November of 2021. I started applying like the beginning of the school year because I knew that I wanted to apply lots of places early action just so that I would like know some things earlier and didn't have to wait all the way up until April yeah. to know whether I was accepted or not. And her hard work paid off in a big way. Smith was accepted to 57 colleges and universities and awarded just about $2 million in scholarships. The recent high school graduate says she used the common black college application where she was able to apply to all 64 for historically black colleges and universities at once. I got into around 40 something schools from the common black app in total and then common app it's um, even the school suggests it to use. I just added all the maximum you could add on there is 20 and so I added all 20 schools that I could do on common app. While well, Smith's time has ended here at East Stroudsburg South High School, she's offering some advice for students that are getting ready to start the college application process. Definitely start early. I wish I started in my junior year. Like I said, COVID took that away from me. If if you want to cast a wide net, cast a wide net. Don't don't listen because some people will say, oh, we'll only do two or three. Just pick uh, your top choice in two safety schools. Smith says if she had listened to others, chances are she wouldn't be going to the University of Michigan on almost a full ride. Some of them are like are amazing schools that are really competitive and super hard to get into. And like knowing that like I've achieved that is just like really awesome. Smith starts the summer program at Michigan this Friday and will continue her studies in the fall. I mean, Eustace, Newswatch 16, Monroe County.